Well, first off, I'd like to welcome the people to Eureka, Nevada. And we're a little town that sits at 6,500 feet. Our population is about 600. Right now, I'm standing in the Eureka Opera House. And the Opera House is rather unique. It was built in the 1880s. We use it actually on a daily basis for conventions and meetings. We do a performance once a month here, and sometimes twice, depending upon the time, the season. This is actually the access to the backstage. Along this wall, you'll see all kinds of signatures um, that primarily over the years, performers have signed the wall. The wall is um, really kind of unique and a wonderful thing to have here at the Opera House. This courthouse was built in 1879. It still maintains some of the original integrity that it had. The courtroom is our district court here in Eureka County. And as you notice, the woodwork that's along the walls in our pews, it also has up top here in the ceiling is a tin ceiling. That's some of the wonderful features of old Nevada history that we still maintain in Eureka, Nevada. Welcome to the Eureka Sentinel Museum. And I'm sitting out here in front of this building that used to be the newspaper up until 1960. And inside, we have a fabulous exhibit, which is actually a printing shop. And it smells like old ink. The museum has all these wonderful displays. This place is open to the public. We get a lot of tourists that come through on Interstate 50 and enjoy being able to take a few moments out of their time of travel and come here and look at some of the, the old history that exists. Eureka, Nevada is oh so close, but a world away. <laughs>